What movies would be a lot shorter if the main character just did what the fuck they were told? Mary Poppins. If the kids were well behaved, Katie Nana would have never left. And so there would have been no need for the charming and magical nanny to arrive. Corolla Bobinski said, Do not go through the little door. She should have listened. I was quite scared of the movie as a kid, even though it's for ages 6 plus here. It had a really creepy vibe to it, it almost felt like a horror movie to me. It is a horror movie, that shit's fucking scary, especially to kids. Labra, babysit your brother, asterisk, main character doesn't go on a drug trip for two hours, asterisk. But then she never would have met David Bowie, but then she never would have met David Bowie's crotch. FTFY friend, oblivion, they would have lived in ignorant bliss. Yay, the one other Oblivion fan, it was pretty good actually, First Blood would just be a movie about a Vietnam vet taking a walk if Brian Denner he didn't pull a U-turn and give Rambo a hassle. He drew First Blood. I don't know how to spell it, but your sentence needs more soaring. John Wick, the car's not for sale. Okay, cool. Just ah, uh, or even just, hey, I live in a city with a ton of mercenaries. Maybe I should call and get a background check on a car's owner. That's a good point. Why are there so many mercenaries in this one city? Sky for Bond you are decommissioned. I time a head out. Sweet. Early retirement. The cavern in the woods. The harbinger wants them to turn back so they do. The end. Except that still probably means everybody dies. The tire blows out. The only driver who passes by offers them a lift and it happens to be in the direction of the cabin. Back on, now taking bets. Pretty sure that was one of those, they have to have a choice moments and they would have been fine. But they would have found another group of kids to fuck with that weekend. Star Wars, Luke just stayed home with his aunt and uncle, gets burninated. Even shorter, Yoda tells Keegan to forget the whole Anakin thing. No Darth Vader, probably even no Emperor. Palpatine was already introduced to Anakin and sensed how powerful he was. So Anakin becomes Palpatine's secret apprentice and he becomes even more powerful than he was in. Rots. Asterisk frozen asterisk trolls, your daughter will be mine. Don't be fearful of her powers, because fear leads to destruction. Parents, we understand. Also even though Anna lost her memories of Elsa's powers, Keeping them away from each other for literally no reason would be just cruel so they can continue to play together so long as we set some ground rules to ensure safety. The end. And GT, fear is bad. Teach her how to use her gift. And GT, let's isolate her for the rest of eternity and teach her she's a goddamn monster. And GT, fear is bad immediately shows Elsa a horrifying hallucination. The Truman Show would be much shorter, while The Truman Show would enjoy many more seasons of high-quality programming and blockbuster ratings. I was gonna ask if they really made a series, then I realized that I am an idiot. Spoken like a true Truman, the entire Born Identity series. If he just shot the guy on the boat, he would never be in that mess that he got himself into. Alternatively, if they just left him alone he'd be causing zero problems for anyone. He's living peacefully in another country with his girlfriend, sir. That bath kill hit 28 days later, pretty much any disaster movie if the government listened to the scientists at the beginning. Breaking back, I can pay for your cancer treatment, oh thank you're the man. The end. Not to mention, working for Gus. He could have just stuck his head down, made his millions, and got out. Right, Gus offered Walter everything he wanted earlier. But screwed it all up for Ego and Jesse, the exorcist, Ouija, any and all films involving the Ouija board. Don't play with Ouija board. Okay, we. Yeah, Matrix Neo, sorry, I think you got the wrong number click. You can take the blue pill and forget this ever happened. Great, thanks. If you play Path of Neo, you can actually do that. Just take the blue pill and credits roll. Star Wars Yoda creeps me out. This kid does keep gone. Train him you should not. Keep gone. Oh, okay.
Palpatine, well shit, so Obi-Wan, have you heard of our Lord and Savior, Dark Side? If you have a couple of minutes, I'd love the chance to talk to you about definitely the first Cars movie. If McQueen decided to listen to his team and went into the pit stop, the movie would be already over. over. Edit. Okay. I decided to watch that again. So he did make a pit stop but he refused to change his tires. That's even worse than I remembered. Always bothered me. He's a professional driver. Had been a champion for however long. But they try to spin it as his hubris getting the best of him. It doesn't make any sense. If he were as competitive and skilled as they made him out to be, he'd know how to win. To be fair in Cars 1 it's McQueen's rookie season. While not necessarily a movie, but Hamlet. If he just killed the uncle that he hated, who banged his mom, and who ghost dad told him to kill, Hamlet wouldn't have died, or screwed over Denmark. I was thinking the same thing, ghost dad tells Hamlet in the very first act of the play to avenge his murder. Somehow Hamlet interprets this as act like a madman. Kill your girlfriend's dad for no reason and hire some actors to make Claudius feel guilty. Everyone who dies by the end of the play dies because Hamlet is an idiot. But he doesn't know whether to trust Ghost Dad or not. Maybe it's not his real dad and is the devil in disguise. Pet Cemetery. Cats d don't bury it over there. The ground's sour. Okay, roll credits as they show them driving to the animal shelter. He was never told not to bury it there. The old neighbor shows him where and how to do it. Stupid, frankly. Here, bury your cat here, it'll come back to life. New, no, don't bury your daughter here, it's the AAAAD. The Lego, and that's our entry for, surprisingly dark, folks. The Lion, Mufasa, your uncle is bad. Don't listen to him and stay away from the shadowy stuff. Simba, okay dad. Boomer, nobody dies. Nothing bad happens. Simba obeys Mufasa. Scar dies cause he's a hoe. If Simba did as they were told he would just not go to the elephant graveyard. Mufasa doesn't warn him about Scar and Scar would have probably done the same thing. The main problem with Simba was he did almost everything he was told to do by Scar. He went to the canyon and he ran away after on Scar's suggestion. The only time he didn't listen to him was when Scar told him not to go to the elephant graveyard. The horror movies where they say don't split up, but they do anyway. Also applies to most of my D&D sins. I'm playing D&Amp D tomorrow for the third time. Glad to have this tip. I was wondering about splitting up today, the breakfast, if they did what they were told in the first place, no Saturday detention. Asterisk, excuse me a sec. What are you babbling about? Asterisk, asterisk, while I was saying I'm in the math club, Latin club, and the physics club, asterisk, asterisk, hey. Cherry, do you belong to the physics club, asterisk, no that's an academic club, so so academic clubs aren't the same as other kinds of clubs, asterisk, are. Uh, but to dorks like him, they are. What do you do in the physics club? Asterisk, asterisk, well we talk about physics, properties of physics. Asterisk, asterisk, so it's sort of social, demented and sad, but social, right? Asterisk, asterisk, yeah, I guess you could call it a social situation. At the end of the year we have this big banquet, asterisk, asterisk, so you load up, you party, asterisk, asterisk, well we get dressed up, but we don't get high, asterisk. I can hear this comment, one of my favorite movie, Ferris Bueller's Day Off, just go to school Ferris, how could he have possibly been expected to handle school on a day like that, though? He did have a test that day too. Lord of the Rings. Movies wouldn't have happened if the original character just threw the ring in the fire. Elrond, cast it into the fire. Isilda, okay. Asterisk, toss his ring, asterisk, roll credits. Elrond, cast it into the fire. Isilda, okay. Asterisk, walks towards edge, asterisk, ring, no. Isilda, okay. Asterisk, walks away from edge, asterisk, Batman vs. Superman, Bruce. I'm telling the truth, oh. Okay, Lex Luthor gets his ass handed to him the end.
Bruce Plick marked up technically characters, but Friday the 13th. Stop fucking and amp, save Jason, boom, done, no vengeful mother killing people and amp, camp Crystal Lake stays relatively peaceful. Jumanji just realized from the drums in a tiny box that the damn game is cursed and leave it alone. You fool. Just but honestly, given it's a cursed, sentient board game of unfathomable power and a horrific mean streak, something tells me that burning it would somehow just make things worse. Mulan, that's one way to bring dishonor on the family, and your every dis-